or so. Firstly, we were busting at the market this morning in Wollongong. I did it here in the car and we made $95 in uh, probably an hour and a half, two hours of busking. We're pretty happy with that, nearly $100. Added on top of what we got paid from the markets. Uh, and yeah, you know, we make, make a bit of money today. It's Friday, so we have to get our busking permit today. Otherwise, we won't be able to get it over the weekend. We won't be able to busk over the weekend, which we really want to do. We also have a gig tonight we have to get to, so it's a crazy busy day. I don't know where we're sleeping tonight. Maybe Rob's friend. Hopefully! <laughs> yeah, maybe Josh's friend, maybe some just random, randoms we meet at the gig tonight. Maybe here in the car, maybe on the street. There's many options. Busking permit cost. Available for three months or 12 months. Three months will cost $12. The 12 month permit is $45. Let's put your window down. No, I can't. We're just stuck in a tube of fire. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, we might not survive to Sydney. <laughs> We're in an What? Fuck you're, you're, Sydney! <laughs> <laughs> Sydney, baby! 20 minutes left. I don't think we're gonna make it. We have to. We've got 18, 17 minutes left oh, to get back to the car. Or it costs us 20 bucks. We're we'll paid for? Yeah, I know. 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 I Roselle, Victoria Street at the Ruby. Should be good, it's pretty chill out here. Couple of dollars for the bank and then who knows what's gonna happen. Oh, he's fucking snoring. Yeah, last night I was sleeping on the couch. Rob got back at like 4 a.m., came and slept on the couch, like right next to me. Immediately I fucked off to the corner of the room because he's the loudest motherfucker. His head was like that far away. He was going to be snoring right in my head, so I slept on the cop of the ground just to stay away. <laughs> Uh, Nim, what are you cooking for us this morning? <laughs> One of those ones! <laughs> no, <you're not. laughs> what are you cooking? No, no! <laughs> but I can't find a... Oh, Steve! <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty, so... We played a gig last night at um, Ruby in Roselle. And then today we've just been editing. We've got a couple of the promo videos about 80% complete. We've still got a few more to go. Um, we're about to go have a swim, have something to eat. Then we're gonna get some haircuts. Then we're gonna have a busk. Then we're gonna go to another gig. We're staying right next to the harbour. We're staying with some of Rob's mates, Chad and Bev. And they're fucking real cool guys. They're from New Zealand. So anyone from New Zealand is usually pretty cool. I'm a kid from Vancouver, Canada. I've been in Sydney for about a month now, busking around town. Um, yeah, and uh, just kind of at spots like this, outside Town Hall, down outside uh, World Square. And um, yeah, just a solo act, just singing songs, some original tracks and some cover songs. Only source of income right now at the moment, uh, which I didn't expect myself to be here, but here I am, you know. I figured, I had a, I had a job for a few days, and I figured if I worked that hard at that job, <laughs> and I translated that into working that hard at music, then I could uh, make a living. And so here I am. I probably go out twice a day for a couple hours. Yeah. So about four hours a day, I try to go out 
every day. It depends. If I make if I make good money from donations, then uh, you know I'll take a day off. But uh, right now it's just kind of every day. I yeah. wake up in the morning, practice a bit, go out in the afternoon, take a quick break, evening, and then uh, home. So yeah, it's like a little job. Lately, I've found surprisingly sometimes I can make good money in the mornings. Actually. Um, I mean, lately I've been going on afternoons, but I have like down at uh, Central Station around there, like actually between 10 o'clock to 12 o'clock sometimes I make really good money. And um, yeah, between like sometimes four and six around uh, World Square. I have quite the eclectic collection of stuff. This guitar I got for free actually. Uh, it's not a very beautiful guitar. I've been desperately in need of a new instrument. Um, but I came over from Europe and I had no money. I didn't have a guitar with me, so I got given this one. I just run a little um, pickup on here. Again, it doesn't sound very nice actually, yeah. but I got a new amp over here. Uh, I run a Roland AC33. Um, so that runs on batteries. I mean, it kind of eats through batteries. It runs on like eight AA batteries. And um, yeah, I just picked up like a microphone pack actually from one of the music store here. And that's it. That's all there is to it. Uh, $10 haircut, it was pretty, I think we're pretty happy with it. My beard, my hair's gone, and now I look like I'm civilized again. Yeah. I'm not drifting, but I know how much happier mum will be <laughs> that I don't look homeless anymore. Why is it stop filming me? It's creepy. <laughs> Alright, Rob, this is our goodbyes. First drifter. Today is the day that we have not been waiting for. It's going to be a sad day. I guess, at least you guys will get a proper sleep. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> you know, traveling and busking, it's really admirable what you're doing, and it's not many people that really follow their dreams in the world anymore, so it's really good to be part of it all. So, yeah, thanks guys for letting me come along. We're going to miss Robbie Nim. If you'd like to come for a drive and help out and be on the show, then you can call our referee, Rob. He'll <laughs> give you a good reference for us. Yeah. It's a sad day. <laughs> <laughs> Did you get that? <laughs>